God. So the, so the Hindi knowing girls learn it from that. Huh? Then you will teach them all the children. The next time when we meet, you all must be able to say that. Of all the countries in the world, Hindustan is the highest and the noblest. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Must be able to. Okay, now. Karate Viramato, Pite Viramato, Karate Viramato, Pite Viramato. Place and all groups have been divided so into three, three groups, and each group is doing their own little plays, and also they're all working at their own stuff. Yeah. So, all these will be shown. Yes. On the time, <laughs> I had to sit and see. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, do you like stories? Yes. Yeah. And these aunties ever taught you any stories? Yes. Every day? No. This is very sad. <laughs> Every day should have been taught. Never mind. Once upon a time. <laughs> that is how all stories start. <laughs> long, long. Long ago, once upon a time, a great yogi 
was sitting outside his little cave and in the sandhya time, dusk time, he was just seeing the sky and the beauty of it and he was wondering the Lord who created them all and he was thus sitting down. Suddenly, boom, something <laughs> fell in front of him. Just in front of him. Oh, he was disturbed and he looked. It was a small, small, small <laughs> rat. <laughs> she was wondering, how can rat fall from the sky? So he asked, Ratty, what happened? It was trembling, poor thing. So he took it, put it on his lap and said, what happened? A bird caught me. <laughs> it, 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 it tried to eat me and then it took it on his beak. It was flying. But luckily, I fell down. <laughs> so he said, don't fear anymore. You stay with me in my cave. I will look after you. And there afterwards, every day, little candy, little food, little jaggery, as all given and the rat became hurry. Slowly, slowly it became fat, 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 <laughs> fat, fat, like some other children. <laughs> fat, 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 became he was doing his meditation and his life. He was they are both in the cave. One day, the rat went out to play and suddenly it ran inside, went near the guru, the guru or the teacher and sat in front of him, shivering for the tip of his nose <laughs> to the tip of his tail it was oh, you said darling what is wrong why are you afraid <laughs> a cat has come here and the cat will eat me I said don't worry don't worry at all never fear I will make you a tomcat and the yogi just closed his eyes and said a mantra. <laughs> the cat became a big tom cat. And the cat went out and when he saw the tom cat, the miss cat ran. The cat remained. In the cave, and the master started giving him milk and started eating. One day again, after a few days, the cat ran, the tom cat ran to the master, sat near him, and <laughs> cat, now what happened? The tom cat said, <laughs> What, Swami? Help me, save me. Why? A dog has come there. A what? Dog, dog, dog. Dog. Oh, the dog generally bites the cat. The dog can fight with the cat. Cat and dog fighting like cats and dogs. Children generally fight like that. No, yes, cats and dogs don't fight like that. Oh. So the cat was afraid of the dog and cried out and therefore the teacher said, don't worry, I will make you a big alsatian. <laughs> I won't tell you the mantra because if I tell you the mantra, suppose you do the mantra on another child, <laughs> the poor child will become a dog. <laughs> And the cat became a dog, an Alsatian dog, tall, 
no, I mean the belly small and panting, man. The dog went out and <coughs> the little dog got up, stuck his tail between the legs. <laughs> was so happy. The dog. Now the teacher started feeding the dog. What to do? It's not little good and little jaggery or little food, but of a rat. The cat wanted milk. So he gave milk. And now it's not milk. It's got to be food because the dog eats a lot. And so he has to cook food for it. And he was feeding. One day after some days, that dog came back, <laughs> shivering, shivering. <laughs> the crying unnecessary. Dog is The yogi said, "Keep quiet." <laughs> howling, howling. He said, "What is the matter?" Small tiger has come. Tiger. A small tiger has come from the from the forest into this place. I, go, I will be eaten out. But said, Don't worry, I will make you a lion. <laughs> because that mantra is a little big mantra. Because it has become a lion. Made him a lion. As a lion with a mane. And quietly and graciously. That the king of the forest. It went out. And seeing the lion. Good. The tiger. The lion came back. And the lion came back. Sat in front of the teacher. And felt that. Why not eat the teacher? <laughs> because the tiger likes to eat. And the teacher cannot give him meat because the teacher never eats meat. So the tiger should have gone, the lion should have gone out and eaten something and come back. But instead of that, it forgot that it was only a rat. It is by the blessings of the Guru that he became a lion. But when he became a lion, he said, why not? So the Guru called him, come here, sit down, do japa, do kirtan, do bhajan. He said, which bhajan? Why should I do it? I am not doing it. Right, do it. <laughs> so the lion said, what are you doing? Oh, teacher, you know you are only a man. I am a lion. I can. And it came forward to beat the teacher and to eat him. At that time, the teacher smiled and said, Oh, oh, so you have forgotten everything. Okay. The lion immediately became that little rat. Came <laughs> 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 Not the fat rat, the small rat. As he came from the first day, traveling, the rat said, I am sorry. Too late. When you do a bad thing, you will be punished. That is the nature. If you touch fire, you can't say that, sorry. I won't do it. I am sorry. I am sorry. You have a burn there. You have to put burn all and four or five days you have to go about like that, showing to everybody. <laughs> Don't touch it. Why? Burnt. How do you burn it? I touched fire. <laughs> yeah. After touching fire, you cannot say, please forgive me. The fire will not. The moment you touch, you are burnt. I am a little baby. You should not have burned me. Ah. It is my law. Nobody should touch me. If you touch, you will get burned. Full stop. Whether it is the child or the infant or the mummy or daddy, whoever it is, touch fire, you will burn. If you live bad, you will be suffering. 
Thus the poor Thai lion became immediately the good old rat. Therefore, even though by the blessings of the teachers, blessings of your parents, you become big, big, big children, big people, never forget that I was a little, little baby in the lap of my mummy, and the mummy loved me and looked after me. Never forget that. Don't say that now I am a big one. Mummy, Daddy, I don't want you. Huh? Huh? <laughs> yeah, you will become a rat again. <laughs> <laughs> See that? Always remember that by the grace of the teacher, by the blessings of father and mother, by the blessings of elders, we grow up, and as we grow up, we have to look after them, serve them, respect them.